Hey, everybody. Hope everyone had a great weekend. I'm just winding down my vacation. Uh, as we know, the markets, the crypto markets were crazy. The stock market was crazy. Um, on this Sunday evening here, I'm noticing the S&P futures are jumping on the back of the potential for the government to basically take care of all the depositors, which should calm fears of a bank run, uh, especially amongst the regional banks. I think the most important thing here is, number one, uh, coming into this, the charts were telling us that the crypto market was going down, even at 25,000. I screamed from the top of my lungs saying, hey, listen, guys, we're going to see a pullback here. This is going to be a pretty decent one, too. Um, but emotion had a lot of people saying, no, we're going to go now back to all time highs. The charts are always right. Emotion, your heart, your gut, it means nothing in the scheme of things. All that matters is what the charts are saying. And so ultimately, we were short at 25,000 with a bunch of trades. We went long on Thursday night into Friday and obviously captured about five winners in verifiedinvestingcrypto.com. And again, the key is when everyone else is, is basically greedy, that's when we're shorting. When everyone else was freaking out on Friday, that's when we were going long. Ultimately, the charts were telling us to do that. But again, avoid emotion. Emotion will get you into trouble. The best traders in the world are robotic. That's the key. So again, folks, I hope everyone had a great weekend. Time to get back to trading on Monday in terms of stocks. Crypto keeps trading and we're going to keep making money. Take care.